and hello everyone i am harshada and i am happy to interact with the most energetic and enthusiastic crowd through this ott platform now rather than giving out a big speech let me share with you an interesting story this is an ancient folklore that has been passed down through many generations and retold in different versions the musca tribe was a part of the four big tribes that live deep down in the andes mountains their civilization sat in what is now colombia the musca people were mainly into mining business and had a good knowledge about the natural resources found in the cavity of the earth these people also had a special tradition to be followed when a new king rose to power the law of the ceremony states that before an individual is allowed to become the king he has to spend a specific duration in a cave without any salt products and meditate in deep isolation after that the individual ventures to lake gotabita to take part in the ceremonial process it is believed that during this ceremony the chief to be or the king was covered in gold and he stood on a raft decorated with the tribe's most attractive offerings of gemstone diamonds and sapphires imagine the glitter the raft was then pushed off from the shore to sail in the lake gotabita when the raft reached the middle of the lake the joyous people threw gold coins and other jewelry in the lake to appease the water god or the energies of water this symbolized a new rule being initiated and from there on the individual was proclaimed as a king in the late 15th and 16th centuries the spanish explorers were so amazed by the truth in the story that it prompted them to further search for the place where they believe the tribal gold existed beneath the land and the water in 1545 they found the lake gotabita and drained it although they were successful in finding some traces of gold the city of los gold or il dorado was not found il dorado is a spanish word meaning the gold in english famous explorers like gonzalo francisco and sir walter continued the quest the search for the lost city of il dorado continued for many centuries but they never discovered the place in the end it was concluded that il dorado or the city of los gold never existed the land near lake gotavita was drilled but it did not contain the riches that the explorers sought this story delivers few insights il dorado exists not outside but inside you the purpose of your life is to discover your strength your own il dorado only you can discover yourself like a wild explorer you need to probe deep into your inner self and explore your abilities strength and weakness to realize who you are and build on them a wise man once said the richest place in the earth is not a laboratory museum or library but graveyard because it has so many unused ideas potential and talents eroding in the dust potential is a priceless treasure like gold all of us have the treasure hidden within but we have to dig deep within to get it out so start on your own adventure to find your il dorado thank you and happy exploring